So thank you very much for joining us. I think uh, I'm pleased to have you here at uh, Q Synergy 2018. Great to see all of our old friends, new friends. Let's jointly create synergy. Okay. So I've got a lot to share with you. So let's get started. Okay, this year we've set our event thing as uh, enabling intelligent clouds and also paved the way to 5G and the AI. So in the past so many years, QCT has a pro lot of progress with empowering cloud service providers with our server, storage, and rack system, switch and the rack systems. Now we're seeing you know, more latest trends, such as autonomous car and smart healthcare, which are intelligence, sorry. So we also see the latest trends, such as autonomous cars and also smart healthcare, those type of uh, train. So you may ask us how QCD address this kind of new business opportunities. So I would like to say our goal is to provide an end-to-end -end infrastructure platform all the way from cloud data center, central office to H. And then there are four points very important four points that we've been investing in the incubating our capabilities and uh, offerings, which include AI, 5G, and also software-defined infrastructure, and as well as uh, disaggregate hardware and software. So we've been working on this for quite some time. So let me share some of our progress with our software partner, ecosystem partners, in the following slides. But of course, you know, you will also hear, you know, more in uh, this afternoon's uh, breakout session for more detail, okay? Okay, so let's go uh, on deep on the AI. Let me elaborate how the synergy works in our progress on AI. First of all, I would like to emphasize that you know, we've been having deep collaboration, long-term relationship with companies like Intel, like NVIDIA, and our ecosystem partners, and working on the sophisticated pioneer technology for our customers in the early age, okay? And with our continuous efforts, widening our range of uh, optimized hardware platforms from training to inferencing, providing the best technology and the solution for specific workloads and the solutions across CPU, GPU, FPGA, and ASIC. And it's not only just this, but also with our long-term partnership with uh, cloud service providers, we can easily provide a cloud so solution with AI, 5G solu solution with AI easily for our customers. So this is the synergy of a QCD on the AI deployment. So next one, let's uh, look at the, uh, the synergy of a QCD's uh, five deployment. We have seen virtualization technology reconstructed for the supply chain of a telco industry. And the QCD is committed to this kind of a transformation. Everybody knows that SDN and the NFV have significantly driving the changes. And the QCD here is with our partners to bring you the next generation central office architecture. And speaking of our offering, QCD offers complete 
spectrum of optimized uh, platforms from each central office and the cloud data centers. Providing this kind of a wide range options of building plot blocks actually to meet your workload requirement. Most important thing is uh, QCD is also embraced open and have a long tradition supporting this kind of open source initiatives. And year after year, we contribute our designs to the open compute project and actively participate in the Linux Foundation activities. And let's talk about the optimized design for 5G and the AI infrastructure. I think you, you will see the flash portion. So let me elaborate a little bit about that. Our goal as an infrastructure providers is to provide comprehensive end-to-end -end platforms. QCD's platform can fulfill various kinds of uh, workloads while ensuring quality of service and the mission critical reliabilities. For example, the first one, like a, our mo modular design for, for age platforms can bring the flexibility of networking capacities. And then the next one, the hyper-converged rec scale deployment can fulfill the efficiency for central office with limited resources. And then the third one over there, the software-defined cloud solutions can provide full function capabilities for data centers. So with uh, our solid end-to-end -end product portfolio, QCD is well prepared to pave the way to 5G and AI for our customers. Okay, so let's look back, uh, you know, in the past one year. We have actually done a lot of things, but it's just the beginning. So I would like to illustrate, you know, just give you some uh, of the idea that we've been doing in the past one year. The first one, we joined the first MWC, the picture down the left. This one, this is our first year joining the uh, MWC. And it jointly with uh, Intel, we share our vision of the next generation central office. And why it is so, so crucial for telco is uh, we openly support the more mobile traffic. And also, I think uh, the left-hand upside. This one actually is the, uh, we joined the MWC Shanghai this year. We announced our participation with uh, China Mobile, China Unicorn, China Telco, you know, in the open telecom IT infrastructure project which it aligns with our open vision perfectly. And for AI, we also just won the Taiwan National Center for High Performance Computing project. This project offers petaflops storage and the computing power, which now ranks in the top 40 computing powers in the world. And uh, this project is still in, uh, within the, uh, the last miles. So our software uh, lead, engineering software lead, still trying to fine tune the performance, see if we can get into the top 30. So we're still working on that. So hopefully we, we are going to have a good news, you know, maybe a month from now, okay? And even more, with this, uh, National Taiwan uh, Center uh, for High Performance Computing Project. We also do the liquid cooling, so we can save the energy. Based on our calculation, we can save high up to almost close to 30% of overall power consumption. Okay. So these are all the achievements in this year. But again, as I just said, it, it's, everything just started. So we're looking, you know, much better future. 
Okay, let's change a little bit about subject. You know, I'm pretty happy with the also another activities that we've been uh, reach, reaching, you know, with uh, IBM. I want to show you this is a very ex exciting moment for us because we form up the relationship since July of this year. We announced the partnership with IBM and its complementary partnership that could lead both of us to mutual success. And the reason is, in this partnership, QCD will be focusing on solution integration, performance tuning, and validation. Leveraging our worldwide manufacturing sites for fulfillment. And while IBM takes the lead on the go-to-market of the solutions that we jointly incubate and uh, perform service to our customers and also partners on behalf of QCT. So through this kind of a partnership, we aim to provide our customers with the best in class products from both QCT and IBM technologies. Customer could enjoy the end-to-end -end solution uh, services with single point of contact. Last but not least, it's all built with technology that is already proven by our joint efforts. So I'd like to take the chance to thank IBM. Sergio, I think he's going to uh, be on the stage later on, you know, for joining us and a part of our ecosystem family, okay? Okay, so I think uh, the above is uh, everything I want to share with you in my keynote. And uh, this morning, we have a few more keynotes sessions uh, from uh, in industry leaders, followed by breakout sessions and also AI fireside chat in the afternoon. And uh, this, uh, that will go in depth what I've just brought up. So now, I'll give the stage to uh, Steve, Steve Chen. He's a VP of uh, Quanta, and he will share with us more on telco applications you know, in uh, industry, okay? So let's join, you know. <laughs> Welcome, Steve. Yeah, and uh, enjoy a great day, okay? Thank you. <laughs>